here at Got Soul, ATL, Harrison's hometown. So it's only right that we do a little challenge today. I don't even know what we're doing. What are we doing? If you're up for it. Now, you are kind of an expert in this field. Who can spend or buy the best sneaker with X amount of dollars? So I'm thinking we do one of those. So I'm okay. going to give you $300. No time limit, but I, I think it should be easy. Day, yeah. And we're going to see between me and you who has the better sneaker. We'll go around to like Comet Hive and other people and see who wins this battle. Yeah. Right. Trust you, I do this all day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Last time I did a challenge for him, I spent what, 5,000 in like 10 minutes or something? Yep, yep. So now we got to do a challenge for me. The budget, the budget's not that high though. Mr. Beast, come on. <laughs> we're only doing, I'm doing a $10,000 challenge. We're only doing $300. So one, two, three. I'm officially your sugar daddy. Harris is going to go first. Let's see what it's going to buy. All right, I got $300. $300 in today's market can get you a lot, but also it can be difficult. Reimagine threes around there. I get an SP. SP4 for 300, I'm winning. I got a very clean mocha, man, for three. Woo! Hey, like, first day for 300. Yeah, like, no star loss, no nothing for three. Uh, Is it with a box? OGL. OGL? It comes everything. That's, that's, um, not, that's not bad at all. Yeah, a couple of fours, like fours. A couple of these, uh, under, I got a uh, rookie of the year, two size 13 for three, clean, no star loss on that, OGR. Well, I think I like that mocha. I'm gonna look one or two more booths and All I'd right, like to come back with those. All right, appreciate Thank it. Thank you, man. I wanna go with those mochas, but I know that there's something there. It's lit. You need that in your crib. They want you to do the Uzi dance. Can we get the dance? Oh, Harrison act different on my channel. Oh, the Zions. That's a good one. See. Looking like you're struggling a little bit. No, I, the struggle is that I just want to go buy the mochas. <laughs> I'm doing it. You gonna buy the mochas? Yep, I'm going mochas. I think this is. I think this is a good one. I'm back and I'm doing it. Three. Three hundred. Three flat. Three flat. Let's do it. Appreciate that. All right, Jordan One mochas in a size 13 used OG all. I went with this because they're brand new, like five six hundred dollars, I think. So. This is a good option. So, Kais, you got a challenge. You got a, a lot of work you got to put in. All right, y'all. It is my turn officially to spend three hundred dollars and get a better shoe than Harrison. All right. So, let's go. Let's see what we're gonna get. Whatever I buy, too. Am I keeping myself in mind? Do I want to buy a pair that I can keep or something I have to sell? I think focus on winning the challenge. First. Yeah, focus on winning the challenge. This is like probably the best Dornbecker they've done in a very long time. If they go, he has them for four hundred. It's out of our budget. Could you do three? <laughs> no, he said no. Uh, what size are these? 12, right How much? 530. 530? Definitely out of Definitely the budget. Definitely out of the budget. I thought they were in the 300 range, but... How much are the bread Fords? This is up there, right? 350. Like, 350? I can, I can make a call and I can see if I can get you for 30. What you think? Bread Fords? Same thing with my boys. That's his pair. It's a very good condition pair. This is a classic Jordan silhouette. Make that call. I'm gonna look around. I'll be back. Okay. I'm calling it Thank you, brother. You know, a lot of people might pick that shoe just because it's such a classic silhouette. One of my favorite shoes. I think that's the best Jordan 4 of all time. So, do I want to go like that route, or do I want to try to get something like hyped in the moment? You got them for 300? Hell no. You said hell. <laughs> what do you have? Do you have anything for 300? Pirate Black. Yeah. See. Crazy, this, right? this one right here, right? Three, I can't believe this is a $300. That's why I was shocked. Can I lowball you or no? <laughs> you can, you can lowball me. $300 for the lost and found? You can do that. Okay. Nah, respect, nah. respect. I, 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 had, to, I had to try. Always oh, try. Always try. Always try. Hey, crazy. sometimes you just gotta shoot your shot, you know? How much are these? They're like $420. 420 Bro, everything's in the $400, yeah, yeah, bro. Know, if this was a $400 challenge, it would have been so much easier. You should have done 400 Because right now, sneakers are in a weird space where a lot of them are going for like 200 or, or they're four, 500 yeah. like the Haritos and Zions. So the 300 is like an awkward state. You're taking a lot longer than Harrison to pick the shoe. I am, I am. 250 These are not so bad. These are good prices. That's a good one. This is a good one. He has them for 390. You say you do 300 on this? I'll do three. I'll do all. And this is my That's size. Actually good. If that was my size, I would have kept this it. This is my size. That's a good one too. Oh, yeah. And it's in good condition. You have OG all box. OG all get it for you. Yeah. I say, yo, go watch your videos, hey, bro. What up, boss? How you doing? Yeah, you good? You, man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Let me go see if the guy takes the offer on the bread. All right, let's go see if they took the offer on the bread fours. I'm kind of thinking bread fours just because it's a classic colorway and that might give me an advantage. That's him right here. You got to talk to him. 300? 
I could I couldn't I've got I'm off for higher. Damn. No, it's all good. How much does that Phantom Travis go for? That's like four or five, right? Four, yeah. Four? Yeah. Is that yours? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Would you do three? <laughs> <laughs> I, just, I, I just bought it two minutes ago for okay, 3.30. Okay. Yeah, because so. I was saying that wasn't there before. Yeah, I okay. just bought it. All right, no worries, bro. Thank it. you, guys. All right, let's go get that other Jordan 1. All right. All right, guys. $300 spent. In my opinion, this is a great Jordan 1. And uh, got it, getting it for a good price. Right. There we go. Perfect. Appreciate you, brother. Appreciate you, Thank boss, you man. Thank yes, you sir. Good deal. I appreciate yes, it. Yes, sir. My man. Jordan 1 versus Jordan 1. This is a hard challenge, bro. I don't know how you do this all the time. Harrison got the Mocha Jordan 1. I got one that came around around the same time because I feel like it, it could be a good good contender. Ooh. Around the same price range, yeah. same condition. That's your, your size. Yeah, my size too. My size, 13. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, so we're going to ask people without telling them which shoe is whose so that they're not biased because, you know, more people like Harrison than me. Uh, first off, Mina, you know who's is who, but yeah. we, we gotta have Mina's vote. I'm not being biased at all. I'm really not being biased at all, but I would definitely take the high moons. Let's go! Oh. Bias. That's bias. No, it's not. This to me is like no offense to TikTok shoe. Oh. Like, that's what I see there. It's like a panda dunk to me. Nah. It's a great Maybe shoe. three years ago. You should have brought your it's girl to the shoe. event. Alright, so let's find out what the boys think. I need, need your vote. Okay, need your hold on, vote. hold on, hold on. Drew had something on his shorts. Can you tell me what it is? <laughs> oh, you mother. <laughs> no. I need you guys to vote. Each of your votes counts as one point. Ian Harrison did a $300 challenge. You got the better shoe. So I need you guys to vote. Which one do you guys think wins? I like the blue moons. Two blue moons? What do you think? Focus. Let's go! I got the blue moon. Yeah! yeah. yeah. <laughs> two, two for blue and one for mocha. Did you pay them? Yeah, I did. Okay. He, put me, it's funny. he put us in his Snapchat. Yeah. <laughs> hey, follow me on Snapchat. All right, let's keep asking people. Right now, it's what? Three to one? Yeah. Three to it's one. Rigged, man. Yeah. You should have done, done it on your channel. <laughs> All right, so we decided we want to do 10 total votes. Right now, we're at four. Let's ask this guy right here. Which one's better? We both did, we did a $300 challenge and we got both of these for 300 but which one do you think is the better shoe? Uh, the I'd probably go with these. The Mocha? Damn yeah. it. All right. Oh, yes. Which one do you think is the better $300 shoe? A better $300 shoe? Like for you personally. Which personally? One? Yeah. Personally, probably, probably at the Mocha. Oh so, my God. Which is, it just, it's, it's more Travis vibe, but I like these too. These are cool too. I thought I flipped you a 20 before the show started. Oh, my bad. The blue moons. <laughs> wait, wait, it comes with a pack? It comes with red? Yeah, the see? Yellow, yeah, the yellow. it comes with a pack. All this storytelling. You can cut that. You can cut all that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which shoe wins? Uh, what are you back paying for 300 bucks? 300 bucks for this, I'm doing this. Let's go. Four to three. Let's go. He texted him for sure, like, yo. Definitely did. <laughs> definitely did. I'm, yeah, I'm, being, I'm definitely picking this shoe. Okay, we're, he's winning by one point now. All right, we're gonna ask one of the owners of Got Soul what he thinks. Oh, we got both of them, actually. Damn, bro, I can't lose this challenge. I thought we were gonna have the go away W because Common Hype picked these, but... Oh, they're all on phone calls. <laughs> Behind the scenes at Got Soul, everybody's on a phone call. Who's pulling up? All right, I need your opinion, all right? We did it, me and Harrison did a $300 challenge. Okay. I'm not gonna tell you who picked what, but who you think wins a $300 challenge? Easily the Clay Blue. Let's go! <laughs> Let's go! But, but the only reason why, though, is because you see these almost on like every other table. A lot of people have focus. When do you see Clay Blue? That's Thank my you. love, that's right. my thing. All right, it's Which four one? Four. It's four to four. We did a $300 challenge. Which one do you like? Which one I like more? What would you buy for 300 bucks? Yeah, for you, for 300 bucks. What's this the better? one, 100%. Yeah. Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> Which one do you think wins? 300? Yeah. Straight up? Yeah. What do you buy for 300 bucks? We're tied, baby. Damn We're it. We're tied. Easy. All right, so it's tied up. I, we have, there's a special guest coming, and maybe we can have him be the deciding factor. I think we do that. Yeah? No. All right, let's do it. Basically, me and my boy, we did a little $300 sneaker challenge, right? I got one of them, he got the other. I need you to choose. You're the deciding vote. I just lost. <laughs> Bro, you can't even go wrong. Like when these first drop, yeah. Well, I want these, but damn near everything. Like right. I ain't gonna lie. It's an Atlanta connection, y'all. Yeah, let's go, let's go. Yeah, you, you, you took that one home, bro. Yeah, yeah. Let's go. All right.
Damn, I'm sorry for your loss. It's all good. It's all good. It's all good, bro. You only 10 grand now. Let's go. No, no, no. Let's go. Appreciate you, brother. Great to meet you, man. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right, guys. Harrison has won by one point. Let's go. Shout out to Duke Dennis making the deciding vote. But let us know in the comment section who you guys think actually won. Comment down below. Thank you. Appreciate you. I won. I took the W. Yeah. This is my thing. The challenge is you can't yeah. beat me. Uh, I'm sorry for Any challenge, you. let's go. I'm sorry for stepping up to you. Okay. I challenge you next. You challenge me next? Yeah. Oh, $10,000 challenge. 10000 <laughs> What? <laughs> Chanel shopping spree. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who can buy the better Chanel bag? Let's go. <laughs> no, I do want to let you guys know that the next God Soul is actually going to be where I live in LA. July 22nd at the LA Convention Center. Literally across the street from Staples Center. Yes, I called it Staples Center, not crypto. So, if you're in the LA area, you need to pull up because you already know it's going to be crazy. An LA show. Come on. Last year was insane. Oh, LA God Soul, you going to pull up or what? Yeah, of course. So make sure you guys pull up. I'll leave the link for tickets down below. July 22nd, LA God Soul. Ain't no gimmick. Don't need no gimmicks. Got no limits. No spinning limit.